It is the Frank and Friends Show. Hi, I'm Frank Murphy. I'm Catherine Frady. And Catherine, it's now open. I know. The Axe House Tavern is open, and we are here, and I am excited. Now, the Axe House Tavern just finished remodeling. In fact, they reopened on December 13th. So it's back in business after just being closed for you know a couple of weeks to do the remodel. Um, it's in Sevierville. We are right across from Gorilla Fireworks with those creepy gorillas with the red eyes that stare you down as you're driving. <laughs> oh yeah, just turn right there <laughs> immediately and you'll be at the right place. Yeah, oh, it's lovely here. I can't wait to get inside, check everything out. And uh, you know, it is the, the Frank and Friends show. <clears throat> yeah, I'll what mention, are you wearing, Frank? I just wanted to mention that um, you know, if you wanted to see the longer version of our episode... You can you know, find that at frankandfriendshow.com. Yes, exactly. Where um, you can also buy some lovely merchandise, like Frank what? is modeling for us look, here today. Look at that. Um, at our <laughs> frankandfriendshow.com backslash store. Get yourself a Christmas present yeah. or a New Year's president present. Or <laughs> so if you caught the uh, the short version, the six minute version of our episode at SeymourSmokies.com, welcome in and know that you can find more of our adventures at FrankandFriendsShow.com. But Catherine, the sign says now open. We're going to have a new and improved experience here at the Axe House Tavern in Sevierville. Are you All ready right. to throw? Let's go log in. Well, you know, Catherine, we do the Seymour Smokies Insider Edition. And this is definitely inside. Inside the sign, in fact. The brand new sign for Axe House Tavern is being put up today. Right. And there is literally a man inside. So he's the true Insider Edition. Look at that. <laughs> I say it's logarithmic. It is, you know, logarithmic, lo logish. Oh. Log. Logly. Logly. It's, it's logly. Oh, it is logly. It wouldn't it be, be logly. logly. That's See, how the song go. goes, yeah. You get the camera. I'll I'll casually walk inside. <laughs> okay. All right. How's this looking? That looks great. <laughs> Keep going. Well, here we are inside the newly remodeled Sevierville Axe House, which is now called Axe House Tavern. It wow. is fabulous. I looks love nice. it. nice. It looks great. Clean and refreshed. Yeah. yeah. They have my favorite cider. What is it? Bold Rock. Oh, that's right. Nice top shelf and rail drinks also, and all those beer taps. All the good stuff. Oh, let's check this angle out. Look at that. The lanes all have clever names, Catherine. Let's do a drive-by over here. That's the Bluff Mountain section. Nice. Which, of course, is, you know, well-known around well here. Known. Mount LeConte is even perhaps better known. The Mount nice. LeConte lanes. It's fabulous. And what's the last one? Cove, Cove Mountain. Mountain. Can I join the league? I mean, Wait, you're going to join the Waddles? I mean, I would think it would be fun to join the Waddles. What do I have to do? Well, you have to... Start guess, actually practicing, throwing probably. axes. Yeah. yeah. Well, let's get to it. By the end, I can maybe join Waddle. Sure. Why? <laughs> Sounds hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's go get a table. I at least be able to Waddle. <laughs> <laughs> I remember having been here before that uh, pizza was a big deal on the menu because the same company that owns Axe House Tavern owns Pizza at the Cove, which is well known in Sevier County. Right, right. Um, and they're known for their wings as well. Yeah. But well, look, now there's they've, more. They, yeah, they've expanded the menu. What they've do you know? They've expanded it. And now we're having chicken quesadillas, and they look delicious. This is something you picked out, right? Yeah, being from Texas, this is one of my favorites. All right, all right, Texas, help me eat a quesadilla. You just pick it up with your fingers. If you want to dip yeah. it in the sauce. Do you want or... some of this um, really fresh salsa? I'm just going to. This is so fresh it looks like a salad. But this Here, is a different salsa. Would you like a, salsa. a napkin? Sure, thank you. Okay. Made from trees, cut down by axes. A X E. <laughs> right? <Yes>. Okay. <laughs> <So>. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Mm. In case of Dia, break glass. <laughs> no? No. What do you think? <laughs> good, huh? think? It was good. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's delicious. <laughs> it is delicious. This is good, and it's on their new menu, which also includes like tacos and fish and chips. They have a kids menu, which I tried to order from also. Yeah. Apparently, you were, uh, Catherine was very torn because you know she's half Texan, half British, so she was really trying to decide <laughs> between true. the tacos and the fish and chips. Which is why we settled on the quesadilla. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even realize that about myself, and it's very true. <laughs> I'm gonna sprinkle them on top. Okay. Like it's a garnish. All right. Seems daring. I'm very daring. You know what you might want to do is put down a layer of sour cream that's like the cement. Yeah. And then whatever you put on top would stick to it more. Like, that's a good process. You can do this. Yeah. See what I did? Check, check me out, everybody. We'll see. I mean, come on. 
My favorite part of all the other Smoky Mountain vlogs is when they do this. Look what I'm eating. <laughs> you don't have any, so you have to come. <laughs> To the Axe House, A X E. <laughs> tavern. <laughs> tavern. Oh, but speaking of tavern, look at the head. Look at you uh, drinking fancy over there. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm drinking. I think we've already established that you're a Bold Rock Cider girl. I am. Mm -hmm. and that's what it is. Oh, Bold Rock Cider. Which of those three words so best describes your personality? Bold Rock or Cider? Mm hmm. Hmm, that's a tough choice. It's bold. It's bold, bold Catherine. The answer is bold. <laughs> no, I was gonna bold or rock. I can be rock. You can be bold. Okay, I was leaning towards bold. But I know. Definitely wasn't gonna be cider. <laughs> <laughs> Just got a cider decider. <laughs> These are the classic cocktails, like the old. I mean, Tom Collins. That's something like my parents would drink. That's old school, old fashioned. Have you ever had an old fashioned, Catherine? Maybe one or two. Maybe one too many. <laughs> <laughs> Screwdriver, whiskey sour. Oh, this is really the old school menu. All right. The problem with the old fashions, Frank, is that I don't remember. Good. Good point. Mm -hmm. Now, the other side is what I really like. This is the signature menu where they've got the axe puns of some kind mm. or the axe references. So the bullseye, because you want to throw a bullseye. <laughs> the woodchuck, that's got uh, fireball and hard cider in it. Oh, so it's like a that cinnamon, sounds interesting. cinnamon apple taste. Oh, that sounds good, actually. And I will need a couple of those for Freddy before yeah. we leave. Winter. <laughs> <laughs> All these things mean something in the axe throwing world. I want. What's the clutch mean? Well, I mean, you want to you want to score in the clutch, right? I'm assuming when when, the, when it's down to the last throw and you need to get the higher score, you know, you're. Or do you want to clutch onto your axe before you oh, release it to the bullseye? I'll take that because I was going with um, like in baseball, you know, you get a clutch home run at late in the game, you know, and uh, everybody gets to, and then you score the winning run and whatnot. Yeah. yeah. We're about ready to throw some axes, though. All right, let's do it. All right, let's see mm -hmm. how that works out. It's going to be uh, Freddy versus Frank at axe throwing on the Frank and Friends show. Yeah. Can we put up, like, a Freddy versus Frank? Like All right. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Frank, are you excited? I we're am very excited. We're here with Bobby, and he's going to tell us exactly what we need to do and what you can't do. I'm ready for some action. <laughs> is that a How new do you way? spell that one? X yeah. A X C e. T O. Like <laughs> yeah, okay. I went. So is that a new one? Did I actually get you? Yeah, I think so. I think so. All right. <laughs> <laughs> so Bobby, you're in charge of of axing us. Yep. So before I get started, I got to warn you guys. Uh, yeah. Before I started working here, I applied as a lumberjack. They said I couldn't hack it. So here oh, I am. Fantastic, nice. fantastic. But, uh, we'll go ahead and get started just with the basic rules and how to throw and everything. Oh, yeah. One-handed right. throw. What mm -hmm. you want to do? You're going to pull towards the bottom of the handle here. Keep your arm and wrist nice and straight as well as the axe. And then you're going to go straight up over your head. And on the way back down, you want to release at about eye level. Oh, all right. All right. And two-handed is going to be about the same concept. You're just going to hold with both hands, go straight up over the head, and release. I like it because it looks Fantastic. more brutal. Yeah. And yeah. you want to make sure that you're not flicking your wrist. If you flick your wrist, it's likely that it's going to over-rotate or have a tendency to wobble through the air, it probably won't stick in the we board that way. We don't want it to wobble. Yep, so just keep everything nice and yeah, we, straight. We, we, everything not wobble, nice and straight. We want waddle. We, yeah, we want to do, throwing league. we want to be in the world yeah, waddle, axe throwing league, so waddle. All right, so I'll go ahead <laughs> and Isn't a waddle the thing on a turkey's neck? I think I have a waddle. Yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. something mm -hmm. like that, yeah. yeah. All right. Oh, <laughs> so I'll start with All the right, one Bobby. throw first. We'll see how it goes. All right, just Bobby. over the head. Oh man! Nice, right in there. Nice. Right. See that? Now, Bo now Bobby practices, so Make I'll probably try the same one as Freddy okay. first. I just awesome. I recognize this one from when I was here the last time. Yeah. No, it's more fair if we use the same axe. I know. I'm agreeing with that. Yeah. I'm I'm agreeing. Yeah. I'm just trying to make sure you don't you know drop the axe backwards and hit us all. Yeah. Everyone should watch out. My right hand on the bottom, and then the other one just goes. Oh, forward. instead of on top. I see. I see. <laughs> All right. So if it goes high like that, that just means that you're <laughs> I released too, too early. Too early. Yeah. Freddy uh, is assuming there's going to be another axe house down the road in Kodak. <laughs> Do you want to try? I, I will try. Okay. It sounded like it went through the wall is yeah. what I, I was worried yeah, about. Yeah, it didn't. 
Oh. Oh, see too much rotation. Over rotate it just a little bit, which means you just need to take a step further. Step further, uh, yeah. closer, okay. Nice. Nice. Well done. Well done. Just don't know that one handed is like smart. There it is. Well, I guess one handed it is. <laughs> nice. The S. I'm sorry, is Freddy, hang on a second, Monica. Is Freddy taking selfies over there? Is she, seriously? Let me see. Come on. You're incorrigible. I know. <laughs> <laughs> I know. <laughs> but come on. I mean, look at it. I know. So it's, close. It's, a, it's beautiful. Look at you. <laughs> it's pretty good. We're having a lot of fun here at the Axe House Tavern in Sevierville. Newly remodeled. Monica, thank you very much for your hospitality. And you're the head axe around here. You're the head... The head of axe. I'm the <laughs> otherwise known as the operations manager. Oh, okay. <laughs> Top hatchet. <laughs> Top hatchet, yes. Now, uh, what we're standing in front of is kind of cool. This because we just you just remodeled this place. Mm -hmm. December thirteenth was reopening day, so it's only been. I mean, we're here what literally two days after the reopening. Yes. And this a uh, wall that I'm I'm bumping up against is a new addition. What is the significance? So this is kind of a, a wall to recognize our heroes. We have a program here, a discount program for military and first responders. Oh, which is a, this which, sign over yes. this way. Okay. And so they can come in and they can throw axes for half price. Oh my gosh. That's also, amazing. Yeah. So um, if you are a first responder or military, first of all, you're going to be better at axe throwing than anybody else anyway. So you may as well come in and show off. <laughs> show us how to do it. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic. And yeah. you get a discount, so yes, hey. definitely. Awesome. Yeah, and they can sign the wall and leave their name here. And yes, they can. We uh, of course like to recognize our heroes, and you can sign the wall when you're here. So your sister location in Pigeon Forge has had something like this that's getting pretty full. Yes. And now you've decided to add one now here in mid-December to the Sevierville location. Exactly. Very good. All right. So you still can get prime real estate, you know, because it's literally the wall's two days old right now. Mm -hmm. So. <laughs> yes, come sign our wall. <laughs> oh, outstanding. Well, Monica, tell us a little more about um, you and your family are involved here in the, the restaurant and in the, the tavern, the axing, um, all the things. Tell us a little yes. bit about everything that um, your company offers. So here at, of course, the Axe House Tavern, you can eat, you can drink, you can play, and throw yeah. axes. We have done all of those um, so far. I'd like to point that out. Things. We are yes. check, check, check. Uh, you know, one of our sister companies is, of course, Pizza at the Cove. Nice. And so when we built the Axe Houses, we brought that. You know, we wanted to bring the food yeah. in here as well. So you can do it all when yeah. we were here. Um, so we started out, of course, with the Pizza at the Cove mm -hmm. uh, concept nice. inside of here. And, of course, that grew into the Axe House Tavern. Yeah. We've revamped the menu. And just down the street, um, well, in the same complex here, yeah. we have the Tennessee Grind Coffee Shop. Nice. That's great. Um, and, and you have some coffee drinks here on the yes, menu. Are they similar at the, the coffee shop, or are you going to find more alcoholic coffee drinks here? Alcoholic coffee drinks are here. Okay. If you want your regular morning latte, you would go over there. But I guess what I'm <laughs> what we're saying is you've got a connection for some high quality coffee. Yes. To serve here Definitely. with liquor in it, it's still going to be better coffee than average because yeah. it's from the Tennessee grind. Yes, we ah. actually uh, we work with a local roaster. Uh, oh, if you're nice. familiar with Mahalo, oh they wow, roast yeah. our coffee beans for us. Nice. That means um, thank you in Hawaiian. Yes, Mahalo. It does. I thought it meant trash when I went to Hawaii <laughs> because I went to McDonald's and all the trash cans, instead of saying thanks, they said Mahalo. Yeah. Do people come in here and say X on, X off? No. They should. Ooh, That's not yes. a thing. I'm sorry. You can't. Maybe we should make it a thing. Why you not? Could, <laughs> yes. Hashtag X on, X off. X off. And yeah, maybe you could have like a mentor then who could teach yeah. the beginners how to ax on and how to, ax how to avoid the yeah. chicken wing how to that's, um, yes. yeah. no chicken wing yeah. that means when you stick your elbow out too far we, we've seen a, we've got a few examples yeah. of that no chicken wings <laughs> it does not work they do serve chicken wings and which you can eat yeah. yes. <laughs> but you don't want to be the chicken wing you eat the to... chicken wings don't throw like a chicken wing <laughs> <laughs> this is blade uh, he is the lumberjack mascot of axe mm. house tavern and he's got the you know the glowing lights and he's throwing some lightning bolts so mm, like thor yeah like thor and he's also over on the other side of the the tavern I riding see. in a jeep ah that's who i was taking a selfie with but you have to have a selfie with blade 
Catherine, part of the support for military and first responders is to have an honorary table. And this is the first table you'd see when you come in, the literally first table here at Axe House, and is the fallen soldier's table, always reserved in memory of those who gave all. I love that. I think that's beautiful. Look at that. Nice. No, now ready for the back of it? It says, eat like a royal, play like a kid, throw like a pro. Well, Frank. Yes, Catherine. I'm pretty sure I beat you. Probably. Even though that's not true at all. It's all in the editing. I can make it look, I can make the outcome look any way I wish. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> so we've axed, we've uh, eaten, we've axed, we've, we've done everything. We've had, we've a, you had a hard cider. Yeah. Um, we've checked out all of the new remodeling here at the Axe House Tavern. Full experience. And it is, it is one to continue time and time again, I think. Yeah. You know? Newly reopened here in Sevierville across the street from Gorilla Fireworks with the uh, googly eyes. And uh, first responders and military, be sure to take advantage of that discount. And as you can see, we're getting close to happy hour now because uh, uh, the doorbell keeps ringing. Folks are coming in. I can hear Starting axes throwing and uh, taps being poured. This is a, a real happening place. It really is. And they're open from 11 to 8, Sunday, Monday, and Tuesday, Wednesday, and till 10 on Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Excellent. All right. Well, fun for the whole family. Ages seven and up can throw axes with parental, you know, supervision and whatnot. And if they're toddlers, they get a foam axe, so they can yeah. also play have along. Fun. Yeah. So uh, great fun here. Thank you to Monica and everyone at uh, Axe House Tavern in Sevierville for the hospitality. Find them online at axehousetn.com. And speaking of online, if you happen to find our episode through our friends at seymoursmokies.com, well, good for you. But wait, there's more. Oh, there's so much more. There's so much more. Check out the long version with all of the things at frankandfriendshow.com. Like in the long version, there might be uh, some footage of Freddie actually getting a Missing. Bullseye. <laughs> missing the bullseye. <laughs> I no. only I only got a bullseye yeah. the whole time. So <laughs> oh, I'll make it look good. I'll make it look good. Uh, so do check out our website, uh, frankandfriendsshow.com, for our new merch and for all the long versions of our episodes and for our regular podcast. Thanks so much for watching. This has been a Seymour Smokies Insider Edition. I'm Frank Murphy. I'm Catherine Freedy. And we'll talk to you next time.